All right, here is our final daily reading lesson for the week. Uh, so this one is for Friday, May 22nd. Um, we're gonna investigate this last informational text structure, which is problem and solution. Boy, that sounds familiar. We've learned a lot about that when we're reading narrative and fiction text. What's the problem of the story? How does the problem get solved? That is also something that you're gonna come across when you're doing informational text reading. So basically, it's telling about a problem and showing a solution, okay? So I put in here an article called Saving the Rainforest. Kind of goes back to the um, different texts that we read about rainforest a couple weeks ago. So your job is to go ahead and read this article. Very interesting, kind of sad, but um, just gives you a little bit more information of what's happening to the rainforest. Um, so you've got this. Uh, we did read a little bit about different rainforest products and um, making that connection between texts we've already read. So go ahead and read the article. And then your job, and I actually added this in here. So this part here, I, oops, I just wrote this. So it says, what's your problem? So after reading the nonfiction text, fill in the problem um, and solution puzzle pieces. So really the whole problem in the article is rainforests are being destroyed. Forests and trees are being cut down. So that's your problem. So I want you to go back what kind of solutions did the article share to the reader that um, people could utilize to solve that problem? So it did give some suggestions towards the end of the article. Um, you can do one, two, or three. Um, there is actually a little bit more than three. So make sure you're going back into the text, boys and girls, to um, find that evidence for your answer. Okay? So once again, I want you to read Saving the Rainforest and fill out this graphic organizer to go along with problem and solution.